Good afternoon, everybody. It's uh, it's been a while. As you guys can see, my hair has grown to uh, untamable proportions. And yeah, so I just got off a eight hour shift. It was eight hour shift turned more into like nine hours. But um, we're out here today, gonna do a sunset hike. Um, looks like that's Walt pulling up right now. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. Weather well, not looking too great, but yeah, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. So there's Walt. He has uh, committed to only using the drone today. I'm bringing everything in the kitchen sink as usual. And Hold on, if I bring my, if I bring my camera, I'm gonna have to bring my tripod because I'm gonna want to do time lapse. So I'll be like, I better not. I'm committing to the drone today. Yep. That's what I just took the vlog. Okay, let's go hike to our death. Or at least I am, because. Working eight hours and then hiking is not fun. So, yeah, let's do it. So, uh, Search and Rescue is here. But we don't see anybody up on the trail, so we're just gonna head out and hope that we don't run into some firefighters. Wish us luck. You don't think so? Like number two. Might be high as well. Be pretty bad. You might actually get a little bit of a rain. So we're just trying to figure out who SB is. Uh, Walt, uh, what you... bitch! <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I know you get a hard time talking after. <laughs> So, it's pretty nice. Got some clouds in that direction. Hopefully they don't snuff out the light too much. But all above us is clear for the time being. Yeah, it looks good for the sunset, even if the sunset isn't good. Oh, you just gotta love being out here. But look at this deathly ridge that we just climbed. Oh my God, it just scares me looking at it. So I try not to, <laughs> I try not to look at it too much. Okay, here's Walt. 
up at the top there. All right, time to finish this off. We got some really nice light in that direction. I'm just doing some telephoto shots with my A7R3. Shooting wide open because I have no manual dexterity to enough to control and have a really still hand with the zoom lens. So shooting wide open, cranking my shutter speed really fast, like one over 500. And yeah, just blasting away, launching a couple of light changes on my landscape. Um, not shooting wide angle because all of this, all of that on the other side is pretty, uh, pretty boring looking right now. There's like no light because there's too much clouds. But all the way down the valley, so uh, yeah, just taking it easy, kind of lazy today for sunset. But me and Walt trading some Pokemon and Pokemon. <laughs> Gotta catch them all, right? And yeah, just enjoying the beautiful light. What happened to your hat? Well, I don't know. Now my hair is all fucking jam up. <laughs> it went off the head, around and around and around and around and around and landed second, somewhere second, over there. Second hat I lost. Wow. Ooh, look at this light though. Filling yeah, the. I don't think it's the right time of year for the views on that side. You guys can hear me now that I ducked underneath the wind. Am I at? I'm at 28. Okay, now I'm at 17. All right. Well, the light's pretty much faded, and uh, yeah, what a nice sunset. I'm glad I slapped on the telephoto because this was definitely not the day for like super dramatic wide-angle landscapes. Um, came kind of at the wrong time of year, to be honest. The sun ha isn't really setting. Uh, show you guys 
the sun really isn't setting there it's setting like there so we're not really gonna get light in the valley but what we did get um, is light on the opposite end of the valley over there and that created some super nice telephoto shots so yeah we're about to head down to the car now hopefully we can make it off this mountain without getting blown off thankfully Kylie's headband that I stole from her is still on my head so that's a good that's a win for the day um, yeah just amazing amazing sunset sometimes like when I'm hiking and I don't have a land a wide angle shot then the telephoto is the way to go because you're up so high that you can always pick out wherever the light is and as long as you have your telephoto then you can create something nice even if the big landscape doesn't happen but if your dramatic light does happen then of course you have your wide angle lens to capture that okay i think walt started to head down already so yeah i'm gonna go catch up with him all right i'll check in with you guys later So you can kind of see a little bit of it there. Oh. So you can kind of see a little bit there of that red light that was just over there. Yeah, that's what we were shooting before. It's only faint now, but yeah. Time to start heading down. How's it going guys? So I realized I totally forgot to sign out of the video last time, but Walt and I are back for sunrise a couple days after and we're gonna try and uh, hit up the other ridge. It's looking pretty cloudy, but oh well, we'll go up and see. Why is that even a thing? Oh no, once I get the thing, I Rob sent me. Oh, it's a big lapper, holy shit. How much is yours? The CP will differ for each person. Oh, 108. Yeah, oh, me too. Oh, yours is low too. Yeah. Update, looking pretty good. Sun's gonna rise about there-ish, so. We should have a nice, decent wide angle composition, hopefully. And I'll just scope around my telephoto if the light changes. Rolling clouds. He loves those rolling clouds. Ugh. Baby, how's this cloud? Mean. I don't care. Let's go grab that shot. Go grab that. Alright, so we got the time lapse set up. The sun's rising right there. You guys can see that. I need to put on my variable ND. Walt's got the time lapse set up here. Mm. Yeah, hoping for a banger. Baby, yeah! Oh, let's set up the drone. Yeah, the drone the drone doesn't take good.
Look at this sky. Here comes the live. Yo! One camera, not two cameras, not three cameras, four, cam four cameras! <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Alright, let's keep this light if we can. If no can, then oh no, gotta come back another day. So we got double time lapse going. Walt's gonna send up the drone, get oh, some Oh, we lost the purple, no! Might get a little, at least some like nice yellow. And then I have my telephoto, just picking stuff out. I might throw the drone up too. That was a nice like three minutes. Yeah. <laughs> of footage. Let's go. Well, that was an epic sunrise to say the least. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the shots that me and Walt got. Yes, sir. So crazy. It's so nice from up here. Oh, there my tripod strap. Not tripod strap. Camera strap in the wind. Whew. Now, head back down this, uh, this hill. Down this hill. I can't tell if we hike more or if we uh, play Pokemon Go more. Uh, I think I think there's a balance. You gotta do a little, a little, a little bit of everything. Don't hike and Pokemon at the same time, though. <laughs> Especially not, here. Not, not a good idea. Yeah. yeah.
What if I said there was a Mewtwo? Beware, just move right there. Right, right, right here on this little rock. <laughs> and you and reach, hold your phone like this out. And no. <laughs> I'll get a Mewtwo some, somewhere, some other time. <laughs> Wise guy. Pretty sick. Don't fall. Don't trip. Don't trip. Where is it here? Do I slip here? Oh, I don't see it. Yeah, I don't see it either. Oh, oh well. He did almost fall though. <laughs> Subscribe, go follow Walt on Instagram at Waltzway double A. And that's Waltz with two A's, not Waltzway double A. Never mind. Alright, see you guys in the next one. Signing out with the dirty spikes. Ah man. Well this kind of sucks. Does it say trespassing? No, it says NPC, no parking zone. No parking zone. But there's no, but there's no sign. Yeah, there's no parking sign anywhere around here. <laughs>